Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. State legislatures adopt local regulations that drive up housing costs. Governors and lawmakers across the country continue to propose and implement measures to create a more competitive tax and regulatory climate, in part to attract investment that brings employers and high-paying jobs. However, when there is insufficient and affordable housing supply to to accommodate the influx of families supported by new jobs, then state officials have another problem ahead of them which is the challenge policymakers are currently grappling with in many fast-growing states, like North Carolina, the last one ranked among the top 10 fastest-growing states for the year. Members of the State General Assembly are now considering legislation to de-annex or remove local zoning jurisdiction property in Summerfield, a town outside of Greensboro, where local officials are repeating the rejected the proposed development. Legislators consider the matter to be of statewide interest, because Summerfield is in a part of North Carolina that needs to increase housing to accommodate several massive economic development projects that are expected to bring many newcomers to the area. This move, and related proposals in other states, shows how the debate over housing costs and zoning tends to get heated and upset traditional political coalitions. Summerfield, which was formed in 1996 to avoid becoming part of Greensboro, has such an exclusion zone, allowing only single-family homes to be built in much of the city, and that is on three-acre lots. The move to pass state legislation to de a portion of Summerfield to allow new housing to be built follows years of formal requests to relax those restrictions, and even an acknowledgement by Summerfield government officials that their zoning policy needs to be changed. The Summerfield City Attorney warned the town board in 2021 that its exclusionary zoning practices lead to litigation under the Fair Housing Act. If you want to avoid potential liability, create options in your ordinance that allow for affordable housing, 